Hi friends, here you are at my channel. Today we'll see how to download and install the Walking Dead Road to Survival on PC so we can enjoy with mouse and keyboard even on a large screen. Feeling surprised how an Android OS game will run on computer? Well, we'll show you. You are watching it on the screen, and you may discover how it is actually working. Thus, let's begin. A URL has been provided in the video description or perhaps in the first pinned comment. It's the link, I show it here in case you intend to view it a little bit larger. This URL will take you to the page of the Walking Dead Road to Survival in Bluestacks app. Bluestacks is the software we are going to use to download and install the game as well as play it on computer system. Bluestacks is an awesome software to download and install virtually any Android game on a large screen. We select the Download the Walking Dead Road to Survival for PC button, and then the downloading will start. It'll go in Downloads, look at. Open this downloaded file. In Windows 10, it will have asked us for permission, we enter Yes and Accept. To check out Installer, it's advised to minimize the internet browser like that. The next phase is to select the place in which you want to install it. If we click on Customize Installation, we can pick the directory. In order to carry on, go here on Install Now and Game Installation will begin. The download of game depends on the net speed. It'll then set up the emulator on the PC. The installation process is completed. Do not forget that the PC will require some time to make configurations for Bluestacks and launch it but the next time, it's going to start immediately. The next thing is extremely important. This is an option for Google Play, sign in, you should just click here. Log in to Google Play by providing your email and also password. You cannot still install this game without sign in because it is a Google Play game. In this particular step, we'll just sign in into the Google account. We now have logged in Google Play account. You are supposed to accept the terms and for that, simply press on, I agree, it informs us that if we want to make a backup of our device in the cloud, we select no, you do what you would like. If you want to get back to the computer's desktop, you must click this small arrow. On the screen, the icons of Bluestacks and also Bluestacks Multi Instance will be displayed. Bluestacks icon is basically for starting Bluestacks app. Now, to set up this game, we will simply click second icon. It's the time to install The Walking Dead Road to Survival on laptop or computer so that we'll play this fantastic game on a large screen. Let us head to Google Play and additionally click install. Everybody knows that there are a number of premium tools that you can obtain within the game and so for that, you'll have to choose payment mode in Google Play. For now, we should continue without setting payment mode thus we will click on skip. Now, you will see, my computer is downloading The Walking Dead Road to Survival. In case you have speedy internet connection then it will not take so long as to download The Walking Dead Road to Survival. So I am going to skip and wait for download to end. After installing the game, the icon of The Walking Dead Road to Survival has actually been appeared on the computer's desktop and hence we are able to directly start the game. Starting The Walking Dead Road to Survival on computer is super simple, just click this icon twice and there you have it. Double-clicking icon of the game from computer's desktop is one way to start the game and yet another method is to launch it by means of Bluestacks. We'll just click this Bluestacks icon to begin the game. This is the keyboard setting if you need to configure it. Anyhow, keyboard configurations already look perfect therefore we will just close these settings. If you need to enjoy The Walking Dead Road to Survival in large screen mode then we will certainly suggest two simple solutions. This is actually to expand the emulator, you will have full screen with a border. However, if you'd like to get 100% large screen then this option is not suitable. Press F11 to get 100% full screen then click exactly the same key to exit. No activity in your desktop will disrupt you while enjoying this game in full screen mode. It is obvious that playing a game in an emulator takes a lot of power hence the performance depends on the power of your computer. We'll now quickly look over the way to change the language of the game, for this purpose, you are expected to click on preferences. This drop down menu will display several languages out of which you can pick almost any language. And that's translated. The game has been eventually installed. 
It is ready to play. I will keep sharing such useful videos for you thus remember to subscribe to Usitility and give a thumb up to the video. Thank you for your time, we'll be back again with another exciting video.